what's up YouTube I just wanted to jump on here and get a quick video going of uh, how to maximize the flow into your buffer tank for your pressure washer trailer or truck or box whatever you use um, I'm using a 275 gallon IBC tote for my buffer tank for my 8 gallon a minute machine um, my worry was that I would run out of water at residences or businesses that have low water pressure so I've been trying to think of every way to maximize the amount of water flow into the tank that way it's refilling quicker um, I bought some three-quarter inch flexzilla uh, supply line for the tank um, I did not plumb my reel into the trailer because the manifold inside the reels that I bought are a half inch so I figured that that was going to slow down that water flow and I don't want any anything to slow it down I want as much water flowing into this tank as possible so most of the people on these uh, YouTube channels and most of these pressure washers that I know guys use uh, Hudson float valves which is what I used last year and those do work great but they also slow down the flow of water um, I did watch a video on YouTube there's a guy showing how much slower they are um, but you do need a shutoff valve and I believe I was listening to uh, Jason Guyman podcast or one of his YouTubes where he mentioned a Job high flow water shutoff phone's ringing um, so I ended up buying one these are awesome they flow up to 90 gallons a minute it works just like a Hudson float valve as far as shutting off the water when the tank gets full but it's just a little different rather than it lifting up inside it's external and it just lifts up this this ball floats and shuts off the water when your tanks full so it's really easy to install um, same thing with a you use a bulkhead you just have to go in and go on uh, get something that brings it out to a 90 so that it can plug in the cool thing about this also is this is disconnected from the tank right now but all I got to do is clip it in and turn it so I can take it out clean out this filter on whatever I want it's really easy it's just a twist and a click uh, you can also put these in on the side of the tank but I found it easier to do it the way I did it because it was closer to the hole and I could reach it so if you want to maximize the amount of water coming into your tank so that you know that that tank is being filled as fast as possible I, I suggest this this is gonna flow a lot faster than the Hudson float belt